So we're up on the grow house and in the winter months with the warm temperatures and the high humidity on the inside, the moisture hits the underside of that cold metal because the insulation underneath uh, is poor and the drastic temperatures cause the vapor to turn into water again and, and it starts to condense. But thermal insulation isn't one of the only benefits of spray foam roof. Uh, a lot of roofs fail primarily at the seams and penetrations and where opposing materials meet. And when a foam and coating roof is totally done, it's totally seamless, completely monolithic, and there's no mechanical fasteners because it's totally adhe adhered to the roof. Today's game day, it's everybody, it's what everybody looks forward to is game day. And we're putting two inches of foam down onto the standing seam metal roof. And so this two inches will offer a perfect thermal break for the underside of the, of the roof deck so that there's no more moisture con condensing on the underside of that. We have one of our applicators behind me, relatively new, but he's laying down foam pretty well today. And the objective is to have this bad boy done. It's about 10,000 square feet, should have both the foam and the coating done within two days. And, and after that, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll see what kind of results the building owner's getting.